Assalamu alaikum everyone, I hope you are all having a wonderful day. In today's video, I am going to show you how to factory reset an iPad without passcode using two simple methods. With these two methods, you can reset any kind of locked iPad without even typing the password. So with that said, let's get started. As you can see, here I have an iPad mini 6 which is disabled due to too many wrong password attempts. And now, this iPad is locked. And this iPad can only be unlocked by resetting it. So let's start the resetting process with the first method. Our first method is using a software. For this method to work, you need a Windows or a Mac computer. And after that, you need a software called iMobi AnyFix. You can get it from the link given in the video description below. So just click on free download and install the software into your Windows or a Mac computer. And after installing it, open it up. Once opened, select Reset Device. Next, select Hard Reset and click on the screen button. Click OK. After that, click on iPad tab. And now you have to put your iPad into recovery mode. If you have an iPad with home button, then you have to follow these instructions to get your iPad into recovery mode. So in my case, my iPad doesn't have a home button, so I'm going to select the first option. And I have to follow these instructions to get my iPad into recovery mode. In order to put your iPad into recovery mode, first of all, connect it to computer using your USB cable. After that, press volume up, volume down, and then keep press and holding the power button. Just keep press and holding it. All you have to do is get your iPad into this screen. After connecting your iPad to computer, this software will give you this message. It's asking you to press the trust button on your iPad. Since you cannot access your iPad, you cannot do this, so just ignore this message and close this window. After putting your iPad into recovery mode, now you have to download latest version of iPadOS for your device. As you can see, this software is suggesting me to download iPadOS 17.3. In your case, it will be different. And there are two ways to download the firmware. The first option is downloading the firmware through the software. So just click on download and it will start downloading the firmware. This process will take time depending on your internet speed. And the second option is downloading the firmware through a web browser. If you want to download it through browser, just click on this first link. It will open up your default browser and it will start downloading the firmware. So I'm going to cancel it because I already have downloaded it. So I'm going to select it by clicking on the second link. Once the downloading process is completed, click on reset now and wait for the software to reset your iPad. This entire process takes barely 10 to 15 minutes. So be patient. While this process is taking place, would you please like this video and share it with your friends? For you, like and share is just a matter of clicks, but for me, it means a lot. So thank you so much if you do. Once the resetting process is completed, the software will give you this message. Close it and click on OK. And on the other hand, all you have to do is set up your iPad as if it's brand new. So just go through the setup process. After going through those setup process, your iPad will be unlocked just like this. See? Alright, now let me show you the second method. Our second method is using forgot password option. For this method to work, there are three requirements. Number one, your iPad must be running on iPadOS 17 or above. And number two, your iPad must be connected to internet through Wi-Fi or mobile data. And number three, you must be using Apple ID on your iPad. If you meet these three requirements, then this method will work. If not, then watch the first method. For first method, these things are not required. Now let me show you how this method works. Alright, first of all, input wrong password several times. Then you will see this forgot passcode option. Tap on it. Select start reset iPad. And type your Apple ID password to sign out. Next, tap on erase iPad. After that, wait for your iPad to restart. Once your iPad is restarted, everything on your iPad will be erased including the lock screen passcode. Once your iPad is restarted, now all you have to do is set it up. After setting up your iPad, it will be unlocked just like this. See? That is how easy it is. So there you have it guys. That is how you can reset an iPad without password using these two methods. Please let me know which one of these options were helpful to you. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I would love to hear them. And also, 
If this video was helpful to you by any means, then please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. You are one like and share means a world to me. So thank you so much if you do. And if you want more videos like this in the future, then please subscribe my channel. And I will catch you on the next one. Stay blessed. Stay safe. Bye.